Something's oh. been banging to get in. What are you doing hiding away in here? What do you care? You hate my guts. What we don't come to stick the boot in. Wow, well, it's not quite what I had in mind, but come on, you can't wallow oh. forever. Yeah, too right she can. This is too late for you to be feeling sorry for yourself. So get in the bath, put on a short skirt, and come and help me run your pub. Hey, 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 come on, come on, come on. Listen. Go easy on her, eh? I know she's made some mistakes, but she's still family. And you should never kick a dog when it's down, especially at Christmas. So you go downstairs, I'll be along to help in a minute. Right. As for you, I want you out of that bed. I'll run your bath. It's about time I sorted you out. You are twisted. Why on earth wouldn't you tell me yesterday that you didn't tell Mercedes? Well, to be fair, I did keep him fairly well occupied. Thanks for the loaner, but uh, hot pink's not my colour. <sighs> I took Curtis off at nursery thinking that I may never see him again. Just waiting for the police to come crashing through my door. Why would you do that to me? Because you nearly killed someone I loved. Again. Ugh. Oh. Uh, you'd have a bottle in there somewhere. Though I am slightly more accustomed to higher end than price life fears. Seriously, I'm being totally humiliated and you are cracking open the bubbly. Grace, stop dwelling on the negatives and join me in celebrating our freedom. Hmm? You see, this is exactly why I chose this guy over Mercedes. With her, I had to hide my dark side. James, he celebrates. <laughs> You are as twisted as each other, you know that, right? Might I remind you I wasn't alone, Miss Itchy Triggerfinger. I did it for my brother! And I did it for Harry. You both did it for revenge and love. You see, you're not so different. So here's to us, messed up and proud. Right, I need to pick up Curtis from nursery. So, I'm suggesting if you love birds, want round two, you might want to do it, James's. Yeah, I'm afraid that's going to have to wait until the new year. I've got bags to pack. I'm off for a Christmas break of fondue and five star skiing in Valtzer. But we just got together. Hang on a minute. You're not cracking under the pressure and doing a runner on me, are you? That's preposterous. We've already been stupid once. We came this close to getting caught. I need to know that I could trust you to keep your head. Of course he can. His own freedom depends on it. So does mine! So if you blow this, Trust me, prison is not the worst thing that is going to happen to you. Is that clear? Crystal. Thanks for suggesting a bath. I feel brand new. <laughs> what, you got them dwarfs on for? Cleaning up. You're not going to feel better if this flat's a pigsty. Come here. Let me brush your hair. Um, not why you've been so nice to me. Goldie, you were right. I've caused you no but trouble. Well, I'm not going to excuse anything you've done, Mercedes. But what I don't want is our Bobby growing up with any upset or conflict in his life. So anything I can do to help cut it out, oh. then I shall do it. <sighs> really? You'd really help me fix things and maybe get to see Bobby again. Well, let's just say there's nothing I wouldn't do for my family. Now, why don't you go and put your face on and we can go and help our Goldie behind the bar. OK. DNA, the police will finally get what they want. Their serial killer. Mercedes McQueen. 